What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? And welcome to Survival Fountain of Youth. Now, I've seen this around a couple times, and apparently it's a brutal survival experience. So let's lace up our bootstraps and find out. Grab yourself a monster, and I hope you enjoy the show. Holy crap! table. Alright. Get items from the chest. I can only take two items. Bag of medicine, iron knife, iron spear, navy coat. Oh god. Alright, backpack for sure. A flint, a fishing rod. Oh god, I don't know what to do. What would I want with me? In reality, I'd want a knife. A backpack and a knife. Got it. Jump through the window. I need to make sure I took the right items from the chest. I won't be able to return here. Yeah, I got it. Sailors jumped from their bunks and tried to save the ship, but it was too late. I came to my senses on the sandy shore. My memories were gone. I could not even remember my name. But I was alive and hoped that at least one of my fellow crew members had also escaped. Okay, so, um, apparently we are shipwreck survivors. I skipped the intro and the tutorial, so we're gonna, we're gonna do all this ourselves. And we need to find the pictured grotto. Obsidian. Spotted a few pieces of obsidian on the island, that means somewhere there's a deposit. I should try to explore north of the island near the big rocks. Ooh, view document. Grotto location. So we need to find whale bones, a weird looking rock. And I'm guessing that means the south side of it, possibly, is the grotto. But first, it looks like we need food. We're halfway down on water. We might need to figure out how to actually survive. But here's a coconut. A new blueprint. All right, so we have our backpack, we have a knife, we have a coconut. Crafting. <gasps> Food. A stone cutter. Roasted crab. Rot roasted fish. Okay, medicine. A fire starter. Primitive torch, wooden spear. Primitive bed of leaves. Okay. So it looks like when we find materials, it just gives us recipes. Hopefully this won't be too hard to figure out. Let's just start picking stuff up. Let's unlock recipes. Because you know, that's how you do it in real life. You just pick things up and you automatically know how to do stuff. There's a crab. Ooh, let's go kill it. <gasps> it's so fast. And <gasps> oh my god. Can you like sneak up on him? I don't know how to kill that. That thing was fast. Another coconut. Let's see. See how well his vision is. I 
me. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Oh my god, look at that. I was I was I wasn't sneaky. <gasps> Cut down interaction. Narrow leaves, yellow leaves. Okay, I think I've picked some of these up already. Right? Yeah. So let's see what I can do with those. A knife, a torch. Put a leaf cape. Increases sun protection. Maybe we should do that. A bed of oh. leaves. Oh my god, I've got sunburn. Oh, <gasps> no. Already. Oh, it sucks so bad. Chance of worsening. Oh my god. Chance of recovery, 30%. Chance of worsening, 28%. Near death. I've had a near death experience. It's reflected in my health stat permanently. The health penalty increases each time I faint. Only living water from the fountain of youth can help reduce this. Oh my god, and I did that. I can only faint six times. Alright, well. We need to be in the shade. Let's, uh... Let's harvest some of these. It's gonna take 20 minutes. I have a knife. Why did that take 20 minutes? Crafting. Let's put this on. It takes 20 minutes to make this. Inventory. Is it already on? Okay. Well, we got a little bit of protection from the sun. We need to figure out this coconut, too. Uh, crafting. Coconut. It takes five minutes to open a coconut. I don't know how long it takes to open up a coconut. Eat. Gotcha. Alright. Water's up. What if we make a spear? Can you get wood? No. Just more leaves. What were the dried leaves for? I'm guessing tender? What we got here? Resources, a stick branch sea salt pot distillers holy crap there's a lot what about fire there's so much i didn't see fire maybe we should build we need sticks small sticks well how do we find sticks baits <gasps> We eat those? Date studied. Blueprint unlocked. Oh my. I'm going to be sitting here doing this the whole time. Dried dates. You got to put them in a food dehydrator. What if we just eat them now? Okay, so palm trees don't give you much. They give you palm leaves. I mean, that's to be expected. Oh, here's some, here's some little trees. Get back in the shade. Oh. And how long is that going to take? Five minutes? We have five sticks. Let's see. We should probably make ourselves an axe. Can you make an axe? Stone axe. Improve stone axe. I don't, I don't know what any of this stuff is. I'm guessing that's a stone. But we have sticks. So now we can make a spindle. It takes 40 minutes to make a spindle. Do we have weight? I don't see weight. Am I missing it? Oh. Alright, we're gonna keep going. We still gotta find the grotto. <gasps> I bet it's on the other side of that. Mushroom tender. Oh, ignite duration. I think that said ignite was less than 40%. It's not good. Bird of paradise. Let's just take some live leaves. Ooh. Oh, we can make a bandage. Okay. That's good to know. What the hell was that? What was that? Let's 
sounds like a... Oh, <gasps> there's a snake! Oh, flipping great. Dude, I don't like these animal noises. What is this? <gasps> is that rope? No suitable axe. Oh, we gotta build an axe. But where do we find long sticks? Wait a minute, we don't need a long stick for that, do we? Chamomile. Okay, long sticks. But we gotta go. Let's go find a stone. Stone? Stone pile. Fifty minutes. Right, we gotta find the shade. This is intense. Crafting tools. A stone axe. It takes one hour to make a stone axe. Let's go see if we can get some stuff for a spear. Let's see what happens. Uproot a stump. I don't want to do that yet. That'll take very long. Okay. And then we're going to have to get food soon. But there was rope over here. I'm taking a chance here, guys. I'm probably gonna mess this up. Let's get five of them. There we go. Oh my god. It got dark. I don't know if I really want to stay on the beach or not. See, it's windy, but there's coconut. There's crabs on the beach. All right, so let's let's see. We need to get a fire, a bow spindle. But what's the rope? Tools, weapons. A wooden spear takes 40 minutes. And what does that say? 20. <gasps> 20 okay we're not making that in the, in the dark what about a leaf hat increases sun protection chance of injury oh dude you can't do anything in the dark what if we just try to make it to the grotto it's not far let's do that just gonna pick all this stuff up of scrap. Oh, nope. Is that? We'll put that in our, our bag. Yeah, we're not far away. Let's go to the grotto. Hopefully we can find it. Our stamina sucks. <gasps> Coconut. There we go. We got food. There's the whale bones. We gotta be close. What's that? Rock? A massive stone. <gasps> we got something out of that. Oh, there's more coconuts. Oh, okay, sweet. We got food. Oh, there it is. I wonder if you eat a bunch of those coconuts if you get like sick. Make sure there's no <gasps> there's something in there. What is this? Change. Choose how to act with the building. Move it or disassemble it. What's broken? Can we fix it? Let's let's 
do that later. Oh, there's scorpions everywhere. What is that? What's a puffball mushroom do? Oh, you can dry them. A mollusk. Edible. Restores 8 food and 4 indigestion chance 8%. 21% chance of injury, though. Let's just craft the coconut. Didn't say anything about making a 6, so hopefully that doesn't. Pile of scrap. Oh, <gasps> living water. We got notes. I'm leaving this bottle of living water so that the person who finds it can restore their health if they are shipwrecked. Good luck to you, friend. Ponce's letter. <gasps> Our captain, Juan Ponce de Leon, oh. also survived the shipwreck. Sea currents brought him to this same island just a bit earlier before my awakening. He located the grotto and made it his temporary shelter. Then he started to act quickly and decisively. After building up the temporary camp, the captain began to explore the island. He named it the Island of Hope. During another trip, he heard distant cannon shots. It was a signal from one of our ships. The captain left this note, then hurriedly packed up and sailed toward the sound of the cannon fire. He was in a rush to help his crew. Running quickly, he forgot his spyglass on the other side of the island. If I find it, I will be able to look around the island. Oh, so that's us talking? So we just read the letter? To anyone who reads this, I am Juan Ponce de Leon, head of the expedition studying these islands. I barely survived the shipwreck and arrived here on a lifeboat. I'm leaving this note in case someone on my crew also survived. I spent a few days investigating this island and I'm leaving a rough map and my notes about the island here in this grotto. The island is uninhabited, but is full of wild birds and animals, so be careful. I found ruins and other traces of, of an ancient civilization. This morning, I was exploring a small island in the bay to the east and heard distant cannon fire. This must be a signal from one of our ships. It sounds like it is close to the island. Our rescue boat is still intact, so I will go there immediately to look for survivors. Yes. Just before sailing, I noticed that I forgot my spyglass at the place where I heard the cannon fire. You can look for it. It is in a conspicuous place. I can't say that word. With many fireflies. If you find it, I recommend you take a good look around in clear weather before you go after me. The ancient observatory at the top of the mountain would be a perfect place to do this. It is easy to find. The white symbol above it is visible from almost everywhere. Okay. We got some objectives. Santiago. Oh. I was not destined to complete a map of the local seas, but it may come in handy to find the place where the Santiago sank, not far from this island. Perhaps there's still something useful there. Oh boy. It wants me to get in the water. I don't like that idea. How long do the nights last? Because we should probably sleep. Right? We can make a bed. I'm a little worried about making the bed in this cave full of scorpions. Let's just make it right here. Tell you what, before we make the bed, I just want to make sure there's not a bed already in here. It doesn't look like it, does it? can't really see either. I don't want to run into something. Okay, let's go back. Maybe we should make our bed right here, just because I don't see scorpions around. Yeah? Oh, yes. Takes 30 minutes. Go to sleep. 
Okay, that's not bad. Go one more hour. Let's go two hours. And this whole thing is... Oh. Oh, this whole thing is the map. <laughs> I'm stupid. Ponce de Leon marked the approximate location of two water sources on the map. The coastal grotto and the place where he lost his spy glasses. The captain says that the spy glass remained in a place where fireflies are visible at night. All right, so I don't want to go here. There's wolves or something. But we can run along the beach. I don't really have a map, though, do I? Start the mapping process. Oh, we got to use... I saw the charcoal stuff. Let's go outside. What is that? Oh, the mushroom stalks. Should be able to build a spear now, right? With no chance of getting hurt. Chance of injury, yeah. But it takes 40 minutes. 40 minutes to make that thing. Why can't I do that? Oh, it's locked. That sucks. We have a spear now. I wonder if we should just keep exploring. Let's see. View the document. Let's just go. We're going to keep moving forward. Maybe I should stay. Oh, wait a minute. We can build a hat. A leaf hat. 20 minutes in a leaf skirt and some leaf shoes we have a leaf hat now we should probably uh, cover our feet there we go <gasps> there's something up there I see it oh it's yelling at me what is that let me throw this thing You suck. We got food now. Narrow leaves. Oh, there's another one up there. I see it. Yes. Okay, wait a minute. Is this thing? It does. It can break too. Gotta be careful. Let's go get in the shade. Let's look and see what we can do. I can make a bow spindle. We're doing that. There we go. Now we've got a way to make fire. We're going to make this survival game our little bitch. <gasps> what is that? thing came after me so we gotta be careful like a Mayan temple what is that eucalyptus seeds ancient drawing 23 song of the punishment of the gifted when death had taken the last of the highest ones the great hunt ended with the families and the loved ones of the highest ones who were gifted longevity face an even worse fate than death in battle the day after the end of the hunt all the gifted ones were brought to a high cliff above the deep sea on the island of the birds one by one the gifted were brought to a cliff and fed the poison of the swamp frog which immobilized them and those who drank were thrown paralyzed to the bottom of the sea to drown holy crap at the end of the day, there were no gifted left alive, and their bones rest at the bottom of the sea. The race of immortals was destroyed forever, and only mortals, dying of disease, remained on the island. Dude! That's harsh. Imagine what you have to do to kill an immortal. 
where they just like live forever unless you kill them. Kind of like uh, like demigods or something. <gasps> What's that? Peace of the natives. Yes. You've learned a new way to open up the next region. Open the map. Uh, I don't have any mapping tools. <gasps> Look. That sucks so bad, man. Oh, it's getting dark. I think there was a chance of injury. Right? Even to make a fire. So we're going to keep going just for a little bit. Get out of here, little crab. Pick up all these sticks, though. Dude, I am digging this. I'm digging the story already, man. I'm loving it. Hopefully you guys are loving it, too. And if you are, consider supporting the channel by leaving a like. Maybe even a small comment. But I can't tell you how to live your life, so do what you want. Just keep watching. There's got to be something up here, right? There was something on the map. But, oh, we got a long way to go. Never mind. What is this? Uh. What? What are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? He's the only thing around, right? Oh, I killed the bird! Give me your feathers. You had an egg inside of you. That was crazy. Is that a nest? Oh, it's a bird nest. Give me all the feathers. It takes, it takes 25 minutes to get the feathers out of that? Oh, that little dude's pissed. It sounds like a squirrel. Like, not, ooh, I'm all dirty. Like, not intensely like a squirrel. That noise. The little, I don't know how to describe it. That noise. It sounds like a squirrel. There's big, all right, we're, we're camping here tonight. We're camping here. What is this? Aloe vera? Dragon fruit. Yes? Okay. Um, hopefully. Hopefully we survive the night. A flexible branch. Uh-oh. <gasps> There's a stupid snake. Fuck! Yes, you're not like the snakes in Stranded Deep. You die after one hit. Oh, yep, okay. We're now chance of injury, so... Let's see what's up here real quick. Oh my god. Come here, you little shit. <gasps> oh, I thought he got me. Stone deposit. And there's a cave, I think. Yes. I don't know if there's anything in here or not. I can't see. But, uh. This is where we're sleeping? Chance of. Oh my god, dude. We're gonna have to, though. How much. Can you make a band aid? Let's just do this just in case. Oh, I can't. I gotta use a campfire to create it. Alright. Oh, thank God. Now, ignite it. Oh. Roasted short-eared dog?
Where are you at? Can we make that bed? Yes, we can. It takes one hour to make the bed. Let's sleep for four hours? Five hours. Oh boy. Put that back in our inventory. We're gonna keep moving. We're doing good. But, oh god, there's a scorpion right there. I don't want to get too close to these things. We're going to go find another rock soon, too. I think. Or do we have a rock? What? <gasps> oh, no! No, 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 no. Oh, wait a minute. We can... I'm fine. I'm fine. We, we got away with that one. I feel like I hear stuff. Look at this place. <gasps> it's another one of these stupid things. Get out of here. Ah! <gasps> no. Little jerk. There's trees, though. We need rocks. A cartographer's tree. Place a ladder. I don't know what that means. Uh, no resource. What do you mean? I just need sticks. What's a plutonia? Edible can be gathered from. Gives us food, water. Dude, screw it. Let's just eat it. So the birds just attack you. Maybe if you just get near their nest. Oh my god, it's another one. Go away. Alright, so that gives us sticks. Dude, why is it so hard to get a long stick? And we saw something over here. Yeah, this thing. Oh, it's another flipping bird nest. Oh, God. I'm too close. At least it warns me. Uh-uh. <laughs> Stupid eagle. Wait now. I, I know, dude. Chill out. There's gotta be something up here, right? That's a chicken. A nettle. Pile of scrap. Oh, God. Where's my spear? It's gonna flip and eat me. God bless it. I wasn't ready. Oh, you're just gonna fly away, huh? He's gonna start all that and just fly away? can sleep in here. <gasps> I think we can sleep in here anyway. Wall carving. We'll check that out. Dude. <gasps> There's rope in here. Sage seeds. More wood carving pieces. Of bones, fish bones. I don't know what that is. Feather, obsidian shard. Oh my, yes. Wait. <gasps> what just happened? Oh, you 
you suck. <gasps> Come on. There we go. Where are we at, even status wise? We are hurting. Energy 14. We're gonna put you right there. No? Oh, yes, yeah, you're alive. Oh, is the other one around here then? What is this? <gasps> Living water? All right, we have two now, so let's, let's just try it. Recovery, health, and water. <sighs> oh, that's what I'm talking about. For one thing, it sucks, because I can't eat him. Snake is delicious. When it's cooked right. Kind of like fish. That other stone tablet's got to be over here somewhere, right? Those three of them are missing. We have an axe now. We need to get some sticks. We might just be hanging out by this place for a little while. Though we need to go find a source of water. That's just sticks. 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 Where were the long sticks? It's over here, right? And that thing, we're gonna figure out what that is. I don't know what it is. I don't know what's going on. There we go. Interaction. I don't, wait, didn't I build? I thought I built one. I did. No tool needed. Alright, we got sticks. So what do I need? Build a bow. We have four sticks. I thought I picked up the rope. Oh, I guess I didn't. Or did I pick this up? Is it just these? I don't know. Good God. Let's go back up there. Like I said, I think we're okay. We can just hang out. There's a coconut down there. There's plenty of food all over the place. Crafting. Rope. Alright, we have a rope. Wait a minute. Oh. Let's make two of them. I'm dumb, guys. It takes me a little bit. So we're going to do a weak bow. Oh, I can't make it. I got to build a workbench. How much for a workbench? Good God. I mean, we can do it. This might be our campsite for a little while. Let's go check out this tree. Let's see what this is all about. So we need a rope. Ooh. Well, this looks safe. another weird looking rock great place for mapping oh crab sage oranges long sticks that's legit okay I didn't see no water though there's a uh
Okay. I'm gonna fall. Oh my god, I'm getting like uh, tunnel vision. <gasps> oh god. Oh. I think we're doing okay, guys. Still got a lot of exploring to do, but rotten food. That was the snake. Right? Oh, you suck. Oh, come on, man. There we go. Now, eggs. Oh, well. Upgrade. Oh. <gasps> I can bake eggs. I can make fried eggs. I need another rock, though. Nope. Ooh. Let's get out of the rain. Let's, let's upgrade it. Oh, no! Crap! That looks like another one of these cartographer trees. We got time to get there. Let's go map. There's another coconut. We're good. We're okay. Even if we gotta walk through the night. We're okay. There is so much to explore. And I don't really know what we're supposed to be doing. Like, I'd almost want to build a base right here. But I haven't seen enough to really make that decision. What's up, dude? But, like, we could make a base right here in this cove? Because I think you can build a boat, right? Yeah. We can build a ship. But I gotta learn a blueprint. I'm guessing we need something else. Maybe skin? Leather? These little dudes want some, man. What is that? Oh, it's a pig! Man, that's awesome. Where'd my spear go? Oh, I bet that means that's probably the leather that we need, huh? Maybe? There's a bunch of stuff over here. There's an eagle nest too, so I'm sure he's gonna get pissed. There's something down here as well. Yep, he's all mad. He's about to come after me. I don't know if that was the pig coming after me. It's going to be this bird. <gasps> ha! Oh, that dude came out of nowhere. He sucks, though. What is this? Oh, I see him sitting there. What is that? <gasps> Where's my spear health at? Okay, we're okay. Pick all these sticks up. some more kindling oh I knew it they had the big old briars on them I knew if I touched it, it was gonna hurt me I did it anyway there's rocks Ooh. I got a survival point Song of the Golden Age. And from the day the Palace of Trials was built, the Golden Age began. It was the era of wise chieftains, brave sailors, ingenious healers, and skillful craftsmen. The best of them presented their deeds for the judgment of the Council of Four Tribes, and the Great Four were at the head of the Council. The Council chose the best of the best and called them the Honored Ones. 
The Honored Ones then sailed the Stormbreakers through the fog of the belts to pass through the Palace of Trials on Bimini. <gasps> Is that like Bimini Road? Like in the Caribbean? The worthy who passed all trials were named the highest ones. They drank the waters of fountain to prolong their years and took the water with them in special vessels to give to whoever they choose. Those who were granted such a gift were called the gifted ones. The faces of all the highest ones were carved in stone and the golden age lasted for many centuries. Dude. I'm loving it. There's the tree. All right, we're going to hit this tree, and then we're going to head back. I feel like I'm getting a good, strong foothold. Uh oh, that's a snake. Look at him, he's right there. There's got to be something over there, you know it. It says I cannot do that. I'm falling. That scared the crap out of me. All right, we gotta get back. Can we make you now? Thank you. And I don't know if I actually have anything to cook other than the eggs. That's pretty awesome, though. Look, I still have an egg. Guess you can only make two at a time. Let's uh, let's go to sleep. Booyah! Now we put that in our inventory. Look at that. Our vibe, <laughs> vibe, vibe base. I don't know. Now, character. We have another survival point. We are kicking some ash. We're gonna do this. No, we're not. Better sleep, hunger control, resist poisons, special objects, weapons, ammo, and drop bags. Ooh. Yeah, screw it. Oh. <gasps> it does show us stuff. Maybe those are the, I don't know. Maybe that's the uh, tablets. It is. <gasps> That's awesome. Let's finish this. See? That's why I didn't go nowhere, guys. Where are you at? Yes. That's why I didn't go nowheres. We also gotta build another spear before I get attacked by a bird. We are throbbing, sort of. We still got a lot we got to do. And I know there's wolves in the game, so that's even better. Song of the Fountain. And the great four returned, young and fresh, as if just a few days passed since they sailed off, rather than decades. And they brought happy news to the tribes. The large island was Bimini. Hidden beyond the fog of the belts, its reef and currents, the island was teeming with fruits, wild animals, and plants that were rare on the islands. But the true treasure of Bimini was the miraculous fountain found by the great four in the heart of the island. The fountain's water cured any disease and healed any wound, but even that was not its greatest miracle. Those who drank from the fountain stopped aging for many years, staying young as if time had no power over them. Uh, yes? Bimini. Guys, um, Bimini Road was found in the Caribbean. Some people think that may be the uh, road to Atlantis. Snake. I really thought that was going to do something. But it's fine. Okay. I don't know exactly where we're at. I'm kind of thinking this other big point. So that water is probably up there somewhere. So we're going to go up there. Ooh. Windy up here. And cut down. But that didn't work.
Now that sucks. Oh! What is that? There's water? Miraculous was the water of the fountain, gained by the four tribes. But the fountain was not infinite. Dozens of stormbreakers were going back and forth to Bimini. But there was not enough water for everyone who desired it. And each boat returning from the island was greeted by hundreds of stretched hands, and many of those who desired the potion were worthy of it, but could not get even one sip. And when one person took the potion, a dozen more asked, Why not me? And when one person prolonged his youth, a dozen more asked, Why not me? And the elders saw that seeds of discord were being sown, and that trouble awaits if there is so much envy in the hearts of men. Ancient monument. Snake up there, I think. Let's new blueprint. Let's look at bones. Bones do something. Bone arrows. We should probably make arrows. We just gotta find our sticks. Buffalo potion. You want some, little dude? <gasps> ah! <laughs> He just thought he needed it. Where'd my other spear go? That is a super handy trick. Buffalo potion. All diseases and... Oh, dude, we should have picked that up. Oh, that wasn't a snake. It was a pile of rocks. Ooh, it's windy. That ain't good. It's covered. We're like full on wind. not good almost like it's snowing oh, man. <gasps> oh there's something down there I think we'll be okay right we've got some daylight left I do like how easy those things are to kill. Flexible branches. So we're not needing that. All that's flexible branches. I'm gonna get lost. Nettle. I don't remember what the nettle was. Oh my god, there's a snake right there. <gasps> Dragon fruit. That gave me a lot of stuff, right? It's going to go nice and easy through here. Still got daylight left. So it's dark. I'll take the stone. There's more dragon fruit. Oh man, we got. Come on, little dude. Oh, he can't get through. All right, you little jerk. You that time. Chamomile. Dragon fruit. Oh god, it's not going to be long before we're over encumbered. I can't take the massive stone. This is pretty neat though. There's a scorpion right here. I don't know if that's necessary to throw that at him. I guess we can try it. See how far of a reach we have. Oh my god, there's another one. I 
I feel like that sounds different. Oh no, he's just barking at me. Crap, I want to keep going. It keeps going down. Oh no. Oh god, I'm sick. Yep. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. How do I fix that? I don't know how to fix that. Process scorpion venom? Oh. We should have been picking up scorpion parts. I mean, we did find a cave. Kind of brighten some stuff up, but... Oh. Kind of just came right back out to our little spot. Well, I probably missed something down in there. Oh, look at this. Chronicles, living water. Special object. We may just have to go all the way around. So, let's do that. Do I even have any food? Besides dragon fruit and stuff? I didn't really keep anything. I'm about to spend some time doing some inventory management, I think. So not really in a position right now to build. So... Oh, we do have meat. We have some bird meat. Well, guys, I said we were going to move from this spot. Tomorrow we're going to go to that big rock. How's that sound? Alright, guys. We're going to head to that rock. Harpy Eagle. Put on the shoulders. Why am I doing that? Guess maybe it's a way for us to carry something. Butcher it somewhere else. Let's go through the rocks. That might be stupid, but that's what we're going to do. Maybe we can find a scorpion. So we can get rid of this poison. Oh, <gasps> look, there's a building. And another rock. Take that. What? Dude. Oh, there he is. Guys, I swear my flipping headset flips. It is? <laughs> my headset flipped. It's kind of weird. I think it'll probably fix itself here in a second. What am I doing? There's nothing else up here. What's up here? We're gonna find ourselves in the dark. Like normal. Oh no, I'm not going through all of that. Oh my god, look, guys. Can I even get up there? This is crazy. This is crazy, crazy. I wanted to go over there and I got distracted. There's got to be something up here. Let's 
slowing me down. I don't know if I would actually trust anything like this. That's something right there. Look, can we stand on that? We keep going up. Oh, man. Oh, no. That almost made me fall, I think. It's going to start getting dark. I'm beginning to think this might have been a mistake. No, hopefully there's a way down. That just kind of made a big circle, didn't it? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Can we go down here? I don't want to keep going backwards. It's probably not the right way to go. But this is what we're doing. We're going to go up and around. Oh, no. Oh, God. I think I made a mistake. <gasps> also, guys, I'm sorry. I think I told y'all I was going to get the... Uh... I'm still waiting on that little pop filter to come through, so hopefully it's not bothering y'all too much. Oh, God. Oh, you little jerk. Dude. You kind of hurt me. And I, re I probably I can't repair this one. I have not been paying attention to that at all. We gotta get to the beach. That looks like something of interest. Big giant face. We may have to just build a fire out in the open tonight. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh. Let's see, I probably broke that one. Oh, it's another one of those trees. I mean, luckily we have a lot of energy. Like, I think we can actually make it through the night and still be okay. Then we can come back to that tree. I just wish I knew where I was. Like, I am. I need to turn around and go back through the forest. All right, that's what we're going to do. Now, okay, I'm beginning to read the map a little better now. Oh! I know where I'm at. We just ran all the way around. All the way around the flipping map. We're like right there. Oh, man. I don't know anymore. 
we need to camp out which and i guess we could camp out in the grotto but it's a clear sky so let's do this we'll go to the beach we'll camp out on the beach let's uh yeah we'll just sleep right here probably not gonna get good sleep but we survived another night let's hit this tree up I don't even know if I have any rope I do and we're gonna go that way maybe the uh... crap I don't know I got lost I didn't realize I walked all the way around that see what this part reveals to us I like that these nest I haven't been attacked by an eagle yet <gasps> oh no I don't have a uh... I don't have any flipping charcoal Let's see. So we are headed a bread tree. A cattail. Maybe that means there's water over there. Special object, boars. Yep. Alright, we're just gonna keep going. Let's see what we run into, I guess. Oh my god. I can't believe we just did that. This is water. What is that? Mold. Uh oh. Oh no. thing's gonna kill me. I wonder if I can run from it. Oh god, man. Alright, yeah, run away. Oh god, it's gonna kill me. Oh no, and this thing is broken. And I don't think I got another spear out of this dude. Oh, man. I have my knife back, though. He ran off. Oh, no, he didn't. He's right there. God bless it, man. Should have grabbed the flipping spear out of his face. Oh, I got everything back. We're gonna kill this flipping pig. No, you get your little freaking butt back here and give me my knife. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Jerk. Now, fresh hide. 
There it is. I'm way too encumbered now. It's all this. The pile of scrap. Dead Spaniards map. A map with a blurred inscription in Spanish. The site of some kind of camp is marked here. It looks like the Spaniards were already here long before us. Well. I don't really know. Cattail tender. Okay. Letters to Lucilius. We'll look at those in a second. We gotta figure out water. I'm gonna have to drop this, uh... Dang it, man. I'm gonna have to drop... Drop the hide. I can't use it right now, anyway. We now know where there's pigs. They're not exactly easy to kill, but... <gasps> Coffee seeds. Listen here, you jerk. Mountain trail. Interesting. This note was left by the Spaniards who visited the island long before us. The picture shows a mountain trail and the place where they last lost their friend. It looks like they were able to climb quite high up the mountain. And that's down here towards the bottom. Some rope. Too bad we can't sleep in any of this stuff. No rope. Where are we at? Interesting item, special object. It says special o Ooh, what is this? Berry compote? I don't know what I'm finding. Berry compote. Oh. <gasps> We declared this island the property of the Spanish crown. Two weeks ago, the captain ordered us to leave the Pinta to explore this island and stock up on water and provisions. The island turned out to be a living hell. We have experienced the worst days of our lives here. We have stocked up and are leaving this cursed place, but we are leaving many of our comrades here. Salvador Avila left on the last day of the Southern Well and never returned. Loca Salera died of a snake bite buried in the camp. Felipe Valdez went into the forest for mushrooms, never returned. Luis Herrero crushed by a stone in a mountain cave. The place of his death is marked on paper. Dang. Coffee seeds. Man, again, too bad we can't... Can't sleep here. And what is this? Weight used. It says parameters. Small stick. Can be gathered from octillos and from some of the leafy trees. Oh! It's just a container. We're going to come back here. Boy, right now, we, we got to recover. We got to recover our thoughts. Figure out what we're going to do. Find some water. Oh, my God. We got so lucky again. I can't believe we survived those four attacks. Be honest with you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here we have it. Survival Fountain of Youth. And yes, it can be brutal. Yes, we escaped some near-death experiences. But that's because we're Mad Max, and we will survive. However, I think I'm going to end things here. Please, if you enjoy this content, let me know. Leave me a small comment. Smash that like button, and I will continue the series. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for your love and your support. But now it's time to stay frosty, stay mad, and of course, I'll see you in the next one.